Now, falling rice prices due to oversupply and reduced consumption is becoming an increasingly serious issue in South Korea. In a bid to solve this problem, a local research team is developing and distributing a type of rice that can be made into flour instead. Jong and ju with this report. 60 types of bread of various shapes and flavors fresh from the oven. All are made from rice flour, not wheat. Sales of rice bread in 2022 have increased by more than 50 percent compared to three years ago when it was first introduced. The use of rice flour has also increased from 10 tons last year to 20 tons this year. Rice bread has texture comparable to bread made with wheat flour. The texture of rice is unique in ways wheat is not, so I think it may be even better. Karumi is a type of rice that can be made into rice flour. It's different from most rice and it can be turned into flour without needing to be soaked in water first. It therefore significantly reduces water use, labor and powdering production costs. It's also strong against pests and has a short cultivation period, making it beneficial for farmers to grow. If karumi can replace the demand for wheat flour and reduce the cultivation area of edible rice, I think rice farmers and the government would both benefit. The Rural Development Administration plans to replace wheat flour by increasing the cultivated area of karumi to 42,000 hectares by 2026. A direct payment system for those who grow strategic crops could solve problems of low income for certain farm households. It's necessary to develop processing technology that could lead to increased demand. Although processing prices have been lowered, the cost of making rice flour with karumi is twice that of making wheat flour. If the price problem is solved through mass production and increased government support, then issues related to consumer health and rice demand may also be solved. Jong Eun-ju, Arirang News.